For this video, we're going to take a quick look at the stage storage analysis tool. Uh, we first want to do a quick analysis of this pond. You know, there's some cases where you want to do a high water elevation that's not quite at the interval uh, of the, the surface. Uh, so, for example, this elevation is 5105. Maybe we want the elevation or the volume at 5105.3. So what we can do is go to the surface properties. In my style, I'm going to first turn on user defined contours. And then analysis, I'm going to do a user defined contour analysis with a one for the range. And I'm going to key in the 5105.3 and hit OK. That analyzes the entire surface, the whole surface for that 5105.3. So it's a great little tool for like water pressure zones. Um, random elevations that you need to maybe display on your maps. So now that we have our surface kind of set up how we want it, I'm going to go to the Analyze tab. Under Design, I'm going to select Stage Storage. We could fill out this report title, project name, so forth. I'm just going to put in Pond A. I'm going to come here to the right where it says Define Basin. I'm going to define it from polylines, and I'm going to extract objects from surface and just pick any part of your surface here. Okay, so that's going to analyze that surface, going to extract all those objects, and then we want to define what we want in our stage storage. So I'm going to say define, and I'm just going to window up to that high water mark or that user defined contour. I'm going to select those, simply hit enter, and as you can see quickly and easily, we now know the volume of that pond at any given interval that we want. If we wanted half foot intervals, we would simply change the contour interval in our surface before we make that uh, analysis 